Did you know that you could add multiple devices to a single Logitech unifying receiver? But it's not as straightforward as you might think. So let's get started. First, you could try to add an additional device by using Logi Options Plus. So open Logi Options Plus app. If you don't have it installed, watch my other video on how to upgrade from Logitech Options to Logi Options Plus. Link in the description. Here you could see an option called add device select it now to be able to add another device your receiver must be a unifying receiver so look at your receiver and make sure it has a star like symbol with an orange background if it has this symbol then it means it's a unifying receiver please note not all logitech receivers are unifying receivers such as my this other receiver from logitech that doesn't have this this symbol so back to the app here you must select logi unifying receiver and right away it will start searching for a new device however in order to make your device discoverable you will need to turn it off keep it off for some time and then turn it back on and here if the search has stopped click on search again and hopefully options plus would be able to find your device but unfortunately for me logi options plus wasn't able to find a new device and if that's the case for you continue watching to learn how to add in an another way so you can close this so now we would need to install another app go to Google and type Logitech unifying multi connect utility from the search result select Logitech unifying software I would also add a link to this software in the description then you should click on download now after the download is complete it, double click on it to install it click on I accept the terms and then click on install and then click on finish as it says in here you're now ready to use your Logitech unifying receiver in this way you will be able to add up to six compatible wireless mice keyboards and other devices with one single unifying receiver here now if you will click on advanced you should be able to see other compatible devices make sure to first select unifying receiver and then if you will click on pair a new device you will get this message saying restart the device you want to connect to your computer so once again turn off and then turn back on your device so that it would become discoverable and hopefully it would be able to find your device and add if you have accidentally closed this app you could open it again by clicking on start and then typing logi and you should be able to see logi tech unifying software select it and this time you could click on next once again turn off your device and then after some time turn it back on to make it discoverable again and then it should automatically go to the next page and say we have detected your mouse mx master so move your mouse to make sure that it's your mouse and if it doesn't move you should select that your mouse is not moving in here and then click on next tip make sure only one of your receivers is inserted to your USB port also make sure that your device is not connected to any other computer so once again turn off your device and then turn back on again and then it should detect it again and this time very quickly move your mouse and hopefully it would move as it did for me and then use your second mouse and click on yes to confirm that your pointer is moving and then click on next and then you should get this congratulations message and click on finish and now you could use your second device using one unifying receiver note not all logitech devices are compatible with unifying receiver for example my this keyboard and mouse don't have a unifying receiver symbol and hence they are not compatible with the unifying receiver that means they can only be connected only with with their own USB receiver. If this video helped you to connect your additional devices, please don't forget to subscribe and like to support my channel. You could also find my other tutorials on the screen. And if you have any questions, please let me know in the comments.